A housekeeper arrested after police say she sold thousands of dollars worth of jewelry that did not really belong to her. ABC Action News reporter Maricela Burgos is live in Largo with more on where she worked and what detectives are saying about this investigation. Maricela? A lieutenant with the Largo Police Department right behind me made it very clear they just started this investigation, which means they are still piecing this together. They also want to know exactly this woman's involvement and how many victims they may have in this case. Largo police detectives believe 24 year old Zabita Boucher used her job as a housekeeper to steal jewelry from at least one person living at Barrington assisted living facility. They say she then pretended it was hers when she sold it at pawn shops. Ma'am, you're charged with dealing in stolen property. Detectives say they're investigating the possibility there are more victims at other facilities. They have not identified which ones. They're also looking at whether there are other suspects related to this investigation. Hi, I'm looking for Zabita. She's I'm with ABC Action News. Her husband is surprised his wife is now locked up. In court this afternoon, authorities say she didn't have any prior arrests. Do you want to respond to the charges against her? I can't really say because I don't know nothing. About. Largo police say she sold nearly $7,000 worth of gold jewelry to unnamed pawn shops. Jewelry that included a men's ring that belonged to a woman's deceased husband and a number one grandma gold charm. You charged with theft from a person 65 years of age or older. So I was surprised because we live together and never see her with nothing or, or nothing, you know. I called Barrington to get an update on this investigation to find out the status of her employment. I have not heard back from them. If you have any information about this case, you should call the Largo Police Department. Reporting live, Maricela Burgos, ABC Action News.